brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. They want to speak out, but it's not culturally it's accepted not. to do so. As a woman, that's why they, uh, they look down on me because they taboo a woman who always say what's on her mind. That explains today's low turnout for a peaceful protest in front of Adeloupe. Among the only ones to show were Bertha Diamond and a few other women. The peaceful protest was planned to vocalize their issues with racism, as well as the recent commuted prison sentences that banished four Chukis men from Guam. As mothers, they, you know, decide to come along to voice how much we care for our children. We came all the way from Chuk to have a better life, but if we, we are not as valuable as everyone, at least give us respect as human beings. We're saying? not asking <laughs> that much, because no matter how low, low, low we are, of all Micronesian, we're still human beings. On the sidelines, Linda Edward showed up today to voice her concerns. Edward tells media she was worried the demonstration would turn violent. I think uh, we should work harder with the, the governor of Chuk, their, their senators, uh, their leaders, uh, actually, and uh, more should be done. I, I don't think there's enough of the uh, uh, of when when they are being uh, uh, when they're coming to Guam for the first time, I think uh, uh, not so much uh, oh, what's that word uh, to 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 inform the, uh, the Chukis community what is expected of them, what what is the rules and the regulations and and what is the outcome of if they do break uh, uh, break the law. Although just minutes late for the plan to protest, Governor Eddie Cavill says commuted prison sentences will continue in an effort to keep the community safe. I'm going to look forward to meeting this woman. I'm going to look for her and, and all those uh, that have some concerns. Uh, this and the decisions that I'm making are all about protecting all the people of Guam. It doesn't make a difference whether you're a citizen or a non-citizen. I'm going to continue to do this. Uh, and. Uh, Again, based on what I have in terms of incarceration in our penal facility, uh, I'm not the one that determined who was in there. So those percentages and numbers are evident. Uh, and because of that, because of percentages, you're, you're seeing a certain ethnicity. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.